Hello, dear tourists. Welcome to Kerwa, Tunisia's historical gem. Let's embark on an exciting journey through time and culture. Our adventure begins in the heart of the city at the Great Mosque of Kerwa, one of the oldest and most important Islamic monuments in North Africa. The mosque was founded in 670 AD, and its magnificent architecture showcases the city's rich history and significance as an Islamic center. As you explore its grand halls and intricately designed minarets, don't forget to take a moment to enjoy the serene atmosphere that envelopes this spiritual haven. Next, we'll head to the Aglaby Basins, a remarkable engineering marvel dating back to the 9th century. These ancient reservoirs provided water to the city and served as a lifeline during dry spells. Fun fact, some locals believe that the water in these basins possesses magical powers. A sip may grant you eternal youth or so the legend goes. Now, let's take a leisurely stroll through the Medina, a UNESCO World Heritage Site that will transport you back in time with its narrow alleys and charming architecture. As you meander through the bustling souks, soak in the vibrant colors, and indulge in the aroma of exotic spices, remember to haggle with the shopkeepers for the best deals just remember. A witty joke may get you a more favorable price. Our path will then lead us to the Sidi Sabi Mausoleum the final resting place of Sufi St. Abu Zama al belawi This enchanting mausoleum boasts intricate tile work and a tranquil garden, making it a peaceful spot for reflection and contemplation. The locals often say that a visit to Sidi Sabi brings good fortune. So, fingers crossed. Prepare for some celestial inspiration as we venture to the Mosque of the Three Gates, also known as the Sidi Amor Abeda Mosque. Its three arched doorways are said to symbolize the three doors to heaven. Remember to snap a photo here, and don't worry, heaven won't mind a tourist taking a sneak peek through its gates. Our next stop takes us to the Bardo Museum, which houses a collection of fascinating historical artifacts, including ceramics, mosaics, and ancient sculptures. It's like a treasure trove of Tunisia's past, and the stories these pieces whisper will captivate your imagination. Now, let's take a short trip to the nearby city of El Gem to witness the awe-inspiring Roman amphitheater. This colossal structure, built in the 3rd century, once hosted thrilling gladiator battles. You can almost hear the roar of the crowd and feel the excitement in the air. It's a must-see historical site that will leave you speechless. Our last destination before bidding farewell to Kerwa is the mysterious Aglabid Pool. This ancient water reservoir has an air of enigma surrounding it as nobody knows precisely when or why it was built. Legend has it that it was the work of magical genies, who enjoyed a good laugh while constructing it. So, feel free to chuckle while marveling at its unique design. As our journey comes to an end, I hope you've enjoyed exploring Kerwa's historical wonders, from the sacred mosques to the mysterious pools and everything in between. Thank you for being delightful travel companions, and remember, the memories you've made here will forever be your treasure. Safe travels.